Good evening and a warm welcome to the State of Business on Art Television. I'm Nishani Figuera. Let's have a look at the headlines first. <music> Joint opposition files petition against Judicature Act amendment. Socialist Youth Union urges the government to lift the ban on social media. In tonight's main story, addressing a weekly press conference on the joint opposition, parliamentarian Dinesh Gunawardhan stated that a petition was filed before the Supreme Court against the amendment of the Judicature Act. Gunawardhan further stated that this amendment would remove judicial functions from the judiciary and would indirectly empower the Attorney General and the Director General for the prevention of bribery and corruption. <laughs> अधिकरण संविधान संशोधन पालते पाल में थोड़ी दृढ़पात भी दिवेनो। पांच चार जीएलपी रिस्मेत्तमा सा मामा श्रेष्ठ अधिकारने पालते अभियोगे टल आकर रहते बेनो। धैने टल नीति पति वर्या टल तिबेन नडुवक दूषणे हो वंचा हो अल्लस हो नास्तिय पिलिबंद हो नीति उलंगने या किरीमा पिलिबंद नीति में खटियुत्ता न मैं पाने दें अल्लास कमिश्नरीस वर्याट पैबरेनो में तक कल नीति पति वर्याट सुविशेष व तिबुनो ए आईटीआई लस वेनस किरी मगेने बारा पातले अन्तरुदाय का तत्वयक मातवी मटे इड़ा कड़े पैबरेनो National organizer of the Socialist Youth Union, Eranga Gunasekara, stated that the social media networks should be made available to the general public and that the temporary ban be removed soon. Speaking further, he added that the people who misuse social media networks should be brought to the book and punished in due course. आन दो में जातिवादी प्रवर्तन आठ वक्या नौ नकमती रो। ये वक्य में में महान वोरा ऐतिहासिक सिद्धि ये मटे में आन दो वक्या नौ नकमती रो। एक ही उत्तर है निमे फेसबुक के तहान आंकर निकल। एक ही उत्तर है निमे वाइब नेता व्हाट्सएप तहान आंकर निकल। सीए टेक के में थी � आंदोलन के तीन तोरण नौना का मतीनो यह मन है तो डील दान ये वा वार्तने में न दिन तमांट वासी आवासी बाले बाले में व्यक्ति आमार का तोरण अपने वटे कंगने ये आंदोलन बाले के नौ में वहाँ मन नेवते आता तो तेरा पात करानो Convening a press conference last evening, the Professional Web Journalist Association urged the government to lift the ban on social media and to bring a code of ethics for these social media platforms. The association also pointed out the difficulties of people whose income is based on social media. Lanka ve social media ni sa jiwat te na laksh tuna hatra kete wada wedi pirisa kinnu. Bishal pirisa kinnu ma me social media mat ya pe na. Eto gote api sielo me deva. Api duraga te na bil adu kara kena tienni social media handa. Aarti kawasin loko han yak pelat ienna Lanka te na salli. Mangheta ne raje baladarin. दान लेना है मैं सोशल मीडिया निशा कोचर इनकम में का कैपिटल लांकावर टेन वाद किया था मैं का मैं फेसबुक तहान वक्त में ही मैं का फेसबुक अभी ही रखी हुई है दिक्कतों में वार नहीं मैं विधि रहना होना हम वो हम देना हो वीपीएन पावे चिकर ला फेसबुक के तो म्यूजियन मूली का राज्य टेकी अन्य लोगों Welcome back, you're watching The State of Business. Diesel and Motor Engineering PLC, together with Mahindra Group of India, introduced the latest Swaraj tractor range to Sri Lanka last evening with the unveiling of two of its latest models. Swaraj tractors are part of Mahindra Group's farm equipment division, which will now be offered through the Demo Agri Machinery Division that brings state-of-the-art agricultural technology to Sri Lanka. The models 855FE and 744FE were launched during the ceremony. With easy-to-use technology, these tractors ensure lowest maintenance cost and enable farmers to fix most repairs by themselves. More than 1 million Swaraj tractors have been sold in India and other neighbouring countries over 40 years. In more news tonight, Hilton Colombo Residencies celebrated 20 years of presence in Sri Lanka with the launch of a newly designed logo and collateral, both signed specially to mark the milestone celebration. The celebrations took place at Hilton last evening. 
Hilton Hotels has launched a series of projects focusing on themes of diversity, inclusion, and training women for leadership roles. Throughout its 20 years of operation, Hilton Colombo has celebrated its presence in Sri Lanka through the launch of a newly built ballroom and two dining outlets. So many additions in making it what it is today. In 2012, we expanded the ballroom to house up, up to 850 guests and two years later we introduced a brand new single room product on level 28, subsequently launched the Basico Bar Lounge and a year later the newly built multi-cuisine restaurant Flow. Over the past four years we also renovated more than 100 apartments since. You may wonder why, it's because innovation and Hilton go together very well. We believe in catering to travel centers consumers and shaping the way people's perceiving hospitality. Columbus stocks ended in the red today. Let's look at the details after this break. Welcome back to the show. Trading at the Columbus Stock Exchange ended on a negative note today. The All Share Price Index dropped 35.35 points to close at 6,519.48, and the S&P SL20 dropped 15.53 points to close at 3,665.52. Turnover over was 1.5 million rupees and 64.2 million shares were traded. And here's a look at the day's foreign exchange rates. And that winds up the show for tonight. Do join us again tomorrow at the same time. Until then, thank you for watching. Good night.